Alright guys, alright, I just did a video and when I was saying, can you see well, well I didn't point the camera down where, because the camera and the screen would, the camera would kind of move, of course the camera would kind of move, but so would the monitor where I could play the game. So I'm gonna pull my I'm gonna pull my Kindle I'm gonna pull my computer close to my Kindle and lower the screen so that way. Oh yeah, bingo! That should be perfect. And now I am gonna try again with the Five Nights at Freddy's 2 improved version. And I'm not copyright. I am just doing what I did in the last video. So no copyright notices are here in this video. And I'm gonna try and play I'm not gonna even play one night at spring trap, no. I really like the animation. Shut up and let's get to this. Oh, come on, where is it? There you are, you little crapper. Welcome to the to new to the newly improved Five Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, a place where children and grown ups come for food and entertainment as far as the eye can see. Sadly that's not the same for the night guards. I love this game, and it's a shame it can't be downloaded on Chromebooks. This, by, added by Heavenly Locked, he says this, I love this game, and it's a shame it can't be downloaded on Chromebooks. That's my computer. So I decided to make everyone who can't play it, I decided to make everyone who can't play a chance to play. Shut up, stomach, you're not in charge. Oh my god, is this an exact copy of the game? Oh shit, I'm going to get a major copyright notice from Scott this time. I really hate myself. It is! It's an exact copy! This is a copycat of Five Nights at Freddy's 2! I can get this game on my Kindle Fire! Is that Chica? Can't tell. Where's Bonnie at? What the? I never got this intro on my Kindle Fire version. <laughs> okay, that's gotta be the best intro to a game. Basically, I know what's going to happen, and trust me when I say this, guys, that this game is an exact copy of Scott's version, so unless you guys want to be copyrighted by this, 
do not play it unless you want to have a copyright notice on your screen. But I will leave a link in the description if y'all really want to play this. For those who don't have a Chromebook, for those who have a Chromebook, I am leave a link. I will leave a link in the description where you can play this if you have not played the game. But trust me, you're gonna want to. Wait a minute, Final Fantasy Freddy's 2 minigame version 4.0. All glitches fixed. Five Nights at Freddy's 2 hacked on scratch. What the? Okay, this I got to see. Never mind, it's just a redo. Basically, basically, what I'm trying to s get you behind. Basically, sorry guys, I just love looking at my reflection. See? Look. It is fun, though. It is fun, though, I gotta admit. See my own reflection in this stuff. And it's hilarious! Right? Now, punch the like button in the face! Like a boss! And high fives all around. Thank you guys. Now see all you dudes in the next video, and make sure to slash that subscribe button and subscribe to Corey Kenshin and Jack Supper Guy and some other followers I followed on. All right, I'm sorry about that, but. Seriously, guys, you do not know how funny it is to look at your own reflection. Because without this thing, I wouldn't have, mm, I wouldn't have been able to do what I did in my last video. And this one is surprisingly, surprisingly short, but not as short as my first video. Give that, give that video a look if you guys can get the chance. Because you will laugh about what the content what the language is in that video. You're gonna laugh your heads off. I mean, there was, I was one, it was one morning I was just uploading some videos. I was actually having to use my little camera, not my Chromebook. This was way before I got my Chromebook. So basically, I think, I think the past, uh, Wait a minute, okie dokie, let me go to me, looky looky, and see what... Video... Oh yeah, this is my 259th episode. Now, basically, I think all the way up to where I got my Chromebook was loads different. Wait a minute, uh, let's see, let's see. Alright, it was on, it was the 71st episode where, game, where, from then on, straight to where you see me today, this is how far I've come. 
Alright, Freddy Fazbear Pizza called at 12 p.m. in the afternoon. I called Freddy Fazbear and I finally got an answer. I was called by... Yeah, and I wanted you to hear this video. And guys, this is a video I've already done, so I'm not copywriting over me. But this video you must hear. Hey guys, what is up? I had just gotten a call from Freddy's Fat from Freddy Fazbear's. I asked them if they had any jobs opening yet. They said no. Oh well you won't believe this. I actually had asked her Have you asked anything during the night? She said she's a new employee. New employee! And I asked her how the pizza is, she said, it's fine. And they weren't planning on moving. I just asked her as well. Well, that part is a lie because I don't know if I still have the number. And if I do, I'm not giving it out because I'm over that shit of trying to call them constantly, constantly, and not get no answer. But there was one call I had gotten, like, during this week. It did say withheld, so I don't know who called me, but next time, please don't do that. Because I literally thought it was a ghost of somebody that was calling me to tell me to behave. I just hope it wasn't. But guys, with all honesty, who called me? Because the the all the phone said was with with withheld. It did not say all the with with. It just said withheld. Who called me earlier this week? Because I was scared shit. Now, I did a video in episode 141. It, I called it glitchy because I actually had found a way to get Mario stuck, so I had to let the timer run out. No, seriously, I had to let the timer run out. Now guys, with all seriousness, I am a fun guy to listen to if you want. Now just, if you want me to do some requests, like, leave them in the comments, but do them if they are only games that I have on my Kindle or on my computer. Because I cannot download games that, I cannot download games. My Chromebook just won't allow it. You and you behave. But guys, with all honesty, I am a fun person. God, am I tired? I'm tired, and I still haven't done my Godzilla and Ghostbuster review. I will save that for the weekend, okay? Because with all honesty, I wasted my whole night with worth of sleep because I was worried that my mom's friend was gonna be coming. So yesterday, I mean, this is honest, I slept at 4. I was falling asleep at 4 p.m. yesterday. <laughs> yeah, it only took about an hour for me to fall asleep. And I'm starting to feel that way again. 
I know the camera can't see it, but I swear to God, I'm seeing double on my hand. I can see doubles on me right now. Hi, me. Sorry if you guys think I'm drunk. I'm not. It's just that I had a weird combination of diet root beer with a Pepsi. Terrible combo if you guys want to try it. Check my Facebook before I go to bed because... And yeah, my fate... My little icon is the Godzilla vs. Biolanti Godzilla pick. Now, with all honesty, I love Godzilla. I don't, I don't even care if it's Zilla Jr. from Godzilla, the complete animated series. Or the animated series. I love Godzilla, no matter what size. I don't care if Godzilla's kissing. Yeah, and these are all pictures I've used as my profile picture I'm looking through. And I've gotten 71 pics. I mean, I'm just reusing some of, some of the same old pictures. I even have a whole list where it shows from the first Godzilla movie all the way to Godzilla Final Wars. And I'm telling you, Godzilla has evolved from a destroyer to the defender of the earth. Where is my picture? Yeah, I used to do, like, zoom close-ups of the Godzillas that I liked. Hey, at least they had got... There was one picture of Godzilla 2014. The world ends, Godzilla begins. Now, that was kind of scary. That, was, that statement was, was scary on the poster. But it has Godzilla's face, but not his eyes looking. How do you, an artist, focus so well and not get distracted by your parents? Because I easily get distracted. I used to have a picture of Mechagodzilla as a profile picture. And the first one I ever did was where Godzilla had that little mark on his chest. It looks like he's in pain. Here's my typing on the picture on my 71st picture. I'm saying, it looks like you're in pain, big guy. And if you're wondering who I'm referring to, I'm referring to Godzilla. And yes, I will like that. And guys, no offense, you cannot beat the... For some people, y'all think the Godzilla vs. Biolanti pick is not that big of a deal. 
Trust me. This was the first movie I ever watched as a Godzilla fan. Now, I mean, honestly. There's a picture of Bonnie without his face from the second game. He's asking, and this was a role play. Does anyone want to do a role play? It has romance. What the hell? Corey Andrew Scott. Uh, has What the hell? And Scott Hogg Hogson, how many people have crush on you? Well, there's a. Uh, I actually need to find out how many people have a crush on me. Amazing app. Play now. Okay, don't know what happened there. Seriously, I need to know how many people have a crush on me. You know what? Fuck it, I'm not even gonna bother. I already went past the time when I said that I, I end this video. So, Samurai Slash. Alright, not Samurai Slash, but. Burn that subscribe button and. Burn the like button in. Find the like button or whip it with a tail and push it. Burn the subscribe button, which means click, click me. All right, here's how I'm gonna say: click on the subscribe button. Burn that subscribe button and punch that like button, like it's. Balloon Boy and Springtrap, and I will see all you dudes in the next video. Peace out.